cruiser Houston with President Roosevelt aboard arrives in Honolulu Harbor. It's the first time a president in office has ever visited America's island outpost. I rename this ship Perth. May God bless and preserve all those who sail in her. As the Australian flag flies at the masthead, all over the ship, the name is changed. Americans could not work or were sick and they were just about dying, they would throw them into this pile where they would just finish up and die. United States cruiser Houston. Lost in the Battle of Java, her fighting spirit still lives in the hearts of her countrymen. The city of Houston, Texas, for which the gallant vessel was named, recruits a thousand volunteers to replace the men who went down. Their battle cry, remember the Houston, and behind this thousand, another thousand, and thousands more to come. Here is America's answer. men must be given their credit. They sacrifice their lives for our freedoms.
Her mighty guns will roar no more, her motors will not strain, to pull her from the deadly bombs that seem to fall like rain. The brave men who manned her stations did not survive that fight, but the Navy's mighty proud of them for the work they did that night.